I am Juan Monsalve. I just turned 21 this year. It's accomplished for me. In the mornings, sometimes I'm happy, sometimes I'm sad. Who can wait white? Buffet. When people ask me what I'm going to do when I graduate Mohawk, I said just wait and see. I was born in Colombia. My birthday is October 3rd, 1996. At 4 p.m. I was born. My brain was shut down. Then the doctor put oxygen on me and it saved my life. Mr. Dawson, you are all wrong with that. I help you when the bathroom was with the butt, butt swollen in it, I tell you everything. Yeah. <laughs> what to do without me next year? <laughs> <laughs> we should keep in touch. <laughs> <laughs> well, been at Bardock's for three years now. Man, but what the fans are made. I will keep in touch with you guys. If I not see you, have a nice time. My team shows. So I need to get into trouble. <laughs> trouble is my middle name. <laughs> no, I'm graduating. Finally. Like you, I trust. Oh, I got accepted to Mohawk. <laughs> That's so cool because I started to shuffle in my life. I guess it was the happiest day of my life because we were waiting that day, yeah? but oh my God, it was so emotional. I know my graduation was Actually, the mom best moment of my life. I could tell my parents who were part of me that day. ¿Cómo te llamas? Monsalve. ¿Cuántos años tienes? I not remember my childhood, but I know I've been in therapies in Colombia. I know this was I squared up with me and my family. I'm happy I am alive. He has a speech apraxia. A speech apraxia is that a connection between the left and the right part of the brain there is like a shortcut, is, is almost what he has. So he, in his brain, he process everything, but when he gets to communicate, there is an interruption. So he start talking about when he was eight or nine years old, but before his communication was so difficult. I was communicating with the finger, with the small words, so it was very hard to understand him. Oh, he, was, he was very frustrated, and that year was so hard for him and for us, because we didn't know what, what is going on with him, because when he was hungry, we didn't know what, what he wants. He just pointed here, hungry, hungry, or something like that. He was, his talk was very primitive. 
we decide to be active parents, so we start working with him different therapies. We did a music therapy, we did horse therapies, we went to the dolphins to swim with dolphins for a therapy. Everything that is stimulating with the brain, the brain will help him uh, because they have like a plasticity in the brain. So we decide to be active and start growing with him. I visited my friends from White Oaks Saturday School to see how they're doing sometimes. Good to see you, buddy. I'm like a big bottle today. I missed you. I missed you, Juan. Yeah, send me your bones. Bring it in. Yeah, you do. So the first time I met Juan uh, was with his mom and dad. They came here looking for a place to um, expand and become more independent. Puppet boy! How are you? Good puppet boy! Good to see you! Good to see you! When they came to me, they wanted to expand that, and particularly independence, because that's what we do with our program here at White Oaks, is to generate a level of independence so that the students can be employable, uh, be, being able to live on their own, to manage their own affairs uh, independently as much as possible. I have a girlfriend named Mackenzie. She's 20, I'm 21, I'm older than her by one year. Who's the spoon? Three. Come on. Stop. Thank you. In August, we just celebrate our two years anniversary as boyfriend and girlfriend. Happy birthday! I'm so happy because Mohawk College is the next chapter of my life. Starting up Mohawk School Hill, I was interested in taking the bus, but it's rich enough to I know which bus to take. I want to feel like not alone. I want you you to feel supported and smiled. I think smiled is very important. I won't like can be hard, but I would like to right now here 
witness to you. I want to help other teens or kids with special needs. I would think I'm would be really good at that. Whatever feel you feeling today, just know you are loved and you are enough.